And these, <coughs> yeah. these metal bits here yeah. have been salvaged from an aeroplane. The uh, Thai Airbus crashed somewhere down in the valley here in 1992. It just flew straight into the mountainside down there. We are, um, that's looking across to Tarapati. We're at Fedi. Uh, we've stayed at the tea house here and we're heading up to the Lorabina Pass which is about 800 meters above us. Uh, we're hoping for nice weather but as you can see it's cloudy so it's going to be a bit cold today and we've had a bit of snow overnight. Um, but um, that's all part of trekking in the Himalayas. in the Lorabina Pass and there's a frozen lake down there. Uh, we we'll have a short traverse. This is Gosankund, Shiva's sacred lake, and it's very different to last time I was here. It's frozen. Uh, we've come up from the Lorabina Pass over there. There's some blue sky now, but it was windy and yeah, windy and epic. And we've come down here, and there's a small temple here on the lake shores, and it's a holy place for Hindus. It's Shiva's sacred lake, so. As you can see, that is Shiva's trident there. And if I spin round, there is there is Adita giving us a wave. And she's charged off ahead of me and arrived first. Um, but we're going to stay in the tea house here overnight. Somewhere down there is Gosankund Lake. But as you can see, it's bleak as a dog today. This is how we had, had a nice lodge. But now we have 2,000 meters of descent. Uh, no views at all. <laughs> so, we have reached Lorabina and there is a full-on storm raging outside. We were fighting into the teeth of it, but we managed to reach the tea houses, and we're now taking shelter with a nice cup of black tea. And we will have to see. <laughs> we will have to see. We'll wait for a lull and then maybe head down a little bit more. <laughs> 